In this video, I'm going to show you how you can find the eigenvalues of a symmetric matrix really quickly and simply. And I've picked a 4x4 matrix because that normally would make it much more difficult. However, with some tricks, we can do it really quite simply. So let's look at solving for the eigenvalues. Obviously, we're going to be solving the determinant of a minus lambda i equals 0. That's the fundamental way that we're going to solve this. We're going to get a characteristic equation and find the solutions of it. It's the determinant where the clever step comes in. So we find a minus lambda i very simply. So there's matrix A minus lambda times i. We can, of course, just multiply the lambda across the leading diagonal and do the subtraction, and we get this simple matrix. So let's look more closely at this result. So we get this matrix, and I'm going to color code it. So it looks like we've got like four blocks. So you can split it into four two by two blocks and I've color coded them red and blue. So we've got a red matrix, which is two by two, and we've got this blue matrix this two by two, just all consisting of ones. And if we block it this way, we can use this property that the determinant of a matrix that's symmetric and looks like this is the determinant of the difference between those two by two matrices multiplied by the determinant of the two matrices A and B added together. And let's work out what this is. So in this bit here, we're gonna do the difference between the two matrices. So we're doing each element, so the one, one, so two minus lambda minus one, and that's obviously gonna give you one minus lambda, one minus one is gonna give you zero. Then we've got, again, one minus one giving zero, and then the two minus lambda minus one, we get that. And we can do the same thing with our a and b, but in this case, we're gonna add it. So three minus lambda, two, two, and three minus lambda. Of course, we're just gonna find the determinants. So we're doing one minus lambda multiplied by one minus lambda, giving us that squared. And then we'll be subtracting zero, which we can ignore. Three times, three minus lambda times three minus lambda, we get this. Two times two is gonna give us four and we're subtracting that. Then we just deal with what's in the brackets. So we can multiply this out, multiplying it out and we'll get this simple expression, minus four. We've got nine minus four is of course gonna give a plus five. And obviously this looks like something we could quite easily factorize. So we'll keep that factor out, factorize into two brackets and we get those. You can of course prove this for yourself, but it's very simple mathematics. And then we look at each of these and we can get the eigenvalues um, quite simply. Of course, we could just multiply these two together and get the cubed, and we end up with these um, eigenvalues. Of course, we have repeated eigenvalues that um, I've neglected for simplicity. So there is how you find the eigenvalues of a symmetric matrix really quickly and really simply. Hope this was useful to you. If it was, like and subscribe, and you can look at some of my other linear algebra videos if that's helpful to you. Thank you for watching.